with the fade coming through. That sets up late smokes for EG, who have already crossed red to get down towards BK. Serato fighting for secret. He's trapped with a nade out. It will do good damage, killing Tarek as well. A bit of a martyrdom for K. Serato, but you will notice the rest of these T's not crossing behind into lower. It's a bit of a fake. It's a bit of a ruse. And out the door, EG go instead. Oh, wrapping on to Henny though. Yeah, he's still holding strong back in the site, and he's in with a little bit more. It's only Stan left. Now, he is deeper than they were perhaps ready for, and he does deal with Yuri. Oh, oh and the follow-up onto Art. Just Vinny left, and Stan, all the oh. damage. What a, what a round from Stanislaw. That's to hopefully give them a bit of an easier path outside. Still need to get past Henny, Ooh. and that can be a challenge, especially with your watchful eyes in Cirque removed, and Vinny... He's taking down players as well. Case Serato wrapping in through main. Proves to be a pain and leaves Breezy all alone. Oh, the barrel. Okay, Serato jiggles. He might know. He might have the info and he could just hard peek this one. But yeah, he's so ready for it. Breezy walks into the firing line. Tech nine. It's not a pretty buy, but they've got to go for it. Try and bounce back, double up. Flash for the Hut players, going quick. Kesarato dodges it, and he will spray them down. Only one on top of the Hut is Yuri falling into Tarek, and EG have the sight for now. There's still art to worry about. He runs through the smoke. What a madman. Trading one for one, though, and through the Molotov for Vinny. I love the aggression for Fury. They're not letting EG settle back comfortably. Ethan in a one-on-one, -on -one, but he's got it done. EG find a fourth. Lovely little clutch there from Ethan. Oh, with the MP9. Not quite exactly. the P90. Let's see. It's not quite the P90. It's even better. In case Serato. Oh, dear. This is a uh, a partial investment around those saved guns for Furia. And it's given over some decent results. Henny chasing down the player in the sight. And, oh, there's a follow-up and a half. So it gets deleted. Status law. Wondering where the rest of his team have gone. Does he go back to B? B's like, man, B's lovely to EG. They just love it. If you go outside, you've got to be ready for Keserato, and he's not. So dig out of the round. Furia find it with that partial investment. Like I said, man, B is the summer home of EG. They just get to come and go as they please. But finally, Vinny's here. Ready to try to evict these unwanted tenants, but Breezy comes in with the trade, and we're back into a four-on-four -four right away with that bomb about to go down. Yeah, mollied off as well. There's even more utility Flashes for EG if they want to get aggressive here. Oh dear, Art's been spotted with the orb. There's four players coming in from ramp for Furious. So if EG can just tuck in tight and don't lose Ethan, things can be good, but there's a molly available. Pushes Ethan out. He gets to another safe box. The grenade to follow. That will kill him, combined with the orb shot through it. And Art does the damage. Keserato finishes the job. Stan from the door, trying to draw attention for these close players to pounce. And they've done it. Breezy with a double. Three in the round. Four. And it's just onto Henny. Breezy doesn't get the ace. He tries to escape and it's Henny to hunt him down and that's a good time for that to be the case right versus EG trying to stay flawless in the group Vinny on the mow down he's got the org didn't even mean to get Sirk he's already got two Henny's here to help out Breezy does get past him but can, can't get past Henny oh, can they my. he lights them up three in the round the hat trick dropping a nade Fury have been caught off by these fast outside to B plays, but instead it's in through main. Henny, how does he get that through? Uh, with the cover, saving Yuri's life, who ducks down behind the CT vent. Stan gets re peeked by another orb, by the way, and that will take him down. Henny's gone in the process, but EG are a man down, going through a smoke is breezy, and he actually catches Yuri as well. Art coming back in with a trade. He's so fast on this A site orb, but Cirque is here as well. Ethan drawing attention outside, and Cirque. Oh dear, another one for Art. He's just playing this Tetris like a demon. Jumping around the boxes, orping through smokes. And that'll be Art with the 4K. He's ready to collect the deck collector that is Art here. To make him pay from the heavens, attention drawn away. Ethan, so many angles to check. And there's the peak from Kay Serato. I actually pushed up past these smokes and he's seen that nothing got a cross outside so he knows that it's not an outside play here from EG now they go through the heart and into case Serato who does find a double Ooh. Tarek on a bit of a tear almost three just short of finding Yuri but a damn good try however his push has left that bomb out in the open breezy 
In with one, but 10 points of health and are also over here towards the squeaky door, now repositioning. Ready to peek in from the heavens the moment that Art makes contact. He does swing ahead of time, and that's given oh, Breezy dear. the 1v1 onto Art. Vinny now left in the hot seat. Only one shot is all that's required, and he's already out on the rafters. It's seven on the board for Fury. Well, you two on that top side, they want to go back to it as well. Smoke on the door, though, denying everything. Here he plays close to the left and run at him in a straight line. He can just lay down the fire, circle with the uh, bomb in the door as well. He is stuck alone. Ramp is still being held by Vinny as well, so no freedom for Serg to run down lower. And Vinny's got him from the side. Fury at eight to six. This is looking like a much better map right now. So Yuri can just hear EG overrunning Ramp. The upside is, is that you do have two fast rotations into this B site who are already here. Oh. And they do make all the difference. Vinny and Keiserato putting up the numbers. And there it is, 9-6 from 6-1 down. They are the victors in a game like this. Oh, they're ready for the ramp push. Henny holding. He's going to flash. He's got to turn back around. They're both here. And Henny's got them both. He has been phenomenal in this game so far. On the AWP outside to the pistol inside, it's Furia taking the free ramp control. Ethan hasn't left. He's waiting here. And he will have a double of his own. Three for Ethan. Bomb dropped as well. Can he stall? Can he survive? And can he fight back? Caserato low and getting flanked. He should be dead. But Stan with the aim punch does win the battle. And now Yuri coming from B. Furia wanted the A site anyway. They just got Baited in, tempted by the ramp control. Ethan had to kill everyone there, and that's exactly what he did. Yeah, there's just going to be so many eyes on him, right? And Ethan, still a threat after taking down three, not even needed. Stan with a double. Things slow down, but not for EG. You want to push the lobby with two. Caserato, great adjustment after the jump of Tarek. He will get caught from the hut, though. Vinny, tight hold, and Breezy pushes in for two. That is not what Fury were ready for. They thought they had the cover, but great shots from Breezy. And now Fury are ducking and diving into B. There's already a couple of rotates here. Flanking in the secret and one in the window. Stan could have them in the back as well. Tarek just needs to buy time in the smoke. And that's exactly what he's doing. They have no idea he's here. Stan could drop the bomb. Tarek's gone. And Yuri follows up. This is great work. Fury have flipped it on its head again. And back up the vent as an opportunity. Ethan's here though. Not for long. Yuri going to A. Breezy on a flank. And they know where he was. Do they know where he is as the bomb gets planted on that top site? They have no idea. Passing each other like ships in the night. What can Breeze do out of the hut? He's going to try to get a fast clear on the site. Finds one on the Yuri. He's so damn quick with the AK. And he's going to stick with the spawn oh fuse. He doesn't have a damn care in the world. It doesn't matter. Neither does Henny. Would you look at that? He said he's been having a bit of a quiet game. He's already in ramp. Breezy's pushed the lobby. K Serato just looks away. Oh. The timing couldn't be worse. And Breezy, not content with one, tries to double up, but it falls to Cirque to get the trade. Stan going to cut down Henny, and that leaves Yuri and R. 2v4. They've got the bomb down, but that's the only thing going for them. They don't know exact numbers in the ramp room either. They know that Stan is back towards secret. Trying to hold on to ramp, but Yuri has got to do a lot here to keep Art alive. To try and play off one another. The rest of the gang pushing their way up. No one's oh checked dear. for Art. And here comes the draw. Oh. Oh, they go. Tarek does trade it out, but they don't find the bomb. They don't find the bomb. Oh, there's not time, Tarek. I, I love that he's tried to stick it, but it's already gone in favor of Yuri, hasn't it? 11 on the board. Not sure well, what happened there. The best laid of plans can still go awry, and that's what's happened here. It doesn't matter. It was never going to be an outside play. It is this A play. But the fact that Cirque had the info means that that many more players were here and ready to respond. And the trades, they've gone Ooh. back and forth, but it is left onto Stanislaw again in the clutch. Out through the vent. Deals with Yuri, but Henny's there to get the trade. Three in the round for Henny. See ya. Let's get down, but Breezy again pushing the hut. He's found a lot of success from that info play. Stan is going to get traded in main after one, but keeping EG a man up in this round. Coming towards heaven is Tarek, making a lot of noise there, there as well. And R with a spray somehow converts that kill. Bomb is hell side. Do they want to drop B where Circus has been waiting all round long? They still have a man in lobby as well. You're going to use the ramp room to go down. Actually, he's just setting up behind the box. Fury just decide to wait. They're like, okay, EG don't know where we're going. Well, let's see if they go for the info. And they do. Breezy dinked. 
or gets a dink to Kesarato, but dies in the lobby. And look at the bombs still waiting on ramp, plus R in the spawn. This is just Furia bleeding the clock and waiting for EG to make mistakes. Oh, and if you give them long enough, maybe those mistakes will arrive. They spot Kesarato, they deal with him. This has opened up a two on two. Furia dropped down into this B site. And Art is wrapping heaven. Ooh, oh, Art, you might spice this round up just a little bit yet. However, oh. it's only fake utility. Oh no. oh, no. Yuri needs this fight, and he does win it just, like, barely. 11 points of health. And Cirque now realizing that it's not a B play, but as he goes up the vent, Art is holding on to it and is going to get the better of him. Now, that was a ballsy decision to make, right? That entire round hinged. And Fury haven't stopped since that point. Back out ramp. Tarek alone trying to buy time. He can drop off into B and just give up the ramp room. He's going to hang around for some more. They expected him to leave and he did not. He will get killed, but Cirque helping out from spawn and doing a lot of damage with the M4 before he departs around as well. Still Kesarata low and Fury trading three to three are going to throw smokes towards B, but if there's one thing we've learned, they're never telling the truth, are they? Back up to heaven for Yuri and his team are going to join him as well. Double lower rotate for EG. They already regret their decision. Breezy's back up the vent in time. Yuri, oh dear, is going to get caught falling onto the heart and Breezy trying to go wide will win that fight but it's traded by the heaven wrap furia sent three players up into the rafters and again it's deja vu down from b up the vent into a lost site ethan even takes 70 damage from a molotov it's not getting easier this should just be it yeah, that was not ideal whatsoever k serato barely dodges grenade death and we have furia picking up the first map of the series 16 on the board for the brazilian Slow, smooth, and smooth is fast. For you to know that, they've gotten to the end of apartments. They are ready to bust on them. Pow, pow. Pow, 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 pow. Here come the flashes. Two in the pit here. Stan and Breezy. Ooh. Overwhelmed, blown out. Oh, Kesarato no. doubles down, and there's a smoke on the site. That is somewhat good for Tarek. It also boxes him in. He can't really have any support at this point. He's trapped on his own yeah, man, with 20 nice. HP. <laughs> Yeah, it's ideal, right? Oh dear, EG, they throw another like deeper motor smoke down so they can cross everyone into the site. And now it's this weird like death match, like match, <laughs> uh, fight for control between site and pit. It's being won by Furia and as it should be. Ooh, oh, okay. Ethan. I'm real slick there from Ethan, but it's not enough. He gets overwhelmed in the site. Henny with the last one in the round and the bison ready to roar to life. The scary thing about the bison is that once it starts shooting, it doesn't have to stop shooting. As Cirque learns the hard way. Oh, oh there's still on. more bullets where that came from, and Tarek will be there to trade. So he's at least got it a bit back under control. Art is like already waging psychological warfare. Ethan. Uh, oh, dear. He Art primed it. He shot all the bullets, yeah, so yeah. Ethan would have to reload. That's uh, 400 IQ. Yeah. Save the buys in case Serato. Yeah, man, we all love Christmas, don't we? So Ooh. down through middle, he's got a bit of a present for Vinny, and Vinny don't love it. So like, not the kind of guy you want to get as your secret Santa. The bit of real estate to have this early on in the round. Kind of makes losing Vinny not worth it entirely, but at least his death wasn't entirely in vain here. And now, oh, boy. <laughs> caught with a nade out. Yuri just runs in with his back turned. This is weird. This is a very slow, creeping push, and at the same time, pretty fast. Like, they get here at a fast pace, and now it just slows down completely. Oh, boy. Not bested by the UMP. Yeah, this one didn't look like it was going to go well from the very beginning, and it doesn't go well at all. So they use all their utility that is left in this round, selling a B fake, while the rest of the gang start to work their way into top middle. Now there's 20 seconds left. So at this point, EG are kind of convinced that they've still got two players on A, but the majority are B leaning. Oh, and no. Art deals with that one oh, B player. But now it's all gotten a bit awkward as these two that were still inside of A are able to hold the ground. Henny lives to tell the tale, but he's got no time to get the bomb down. And so Stan is like <laughs> taking us on a panoramic tour of the site. And he takes one down after time. That is oh. that is one of the weirder rounds of CS that we've ever seen. Art almost catches Ethan out in the open there towards CT, but that's going to cause for a lot of utility to get dumped. And actually, this is just going to be the full-on hit. Art just trying to peer over the smoke. Meanwhile, it's Tarek with one. He's not going to stay alive very long because Art's going to keep oh, racking oh. him up. Rack, rack, rack him. He puts two away, looks for a third, oh. and he finds it on Breeze with ease. That's a bomb plant. Furia all but the round in the bag. Ethan only good for one on his aggression.
And that gives Stannis Law an AWP and a CT spawn point of view. Arc and Orp above it. He cuts off rotations and those B players who weren't in B. Fortunately, Ooh. Penny, though, real quick with it, puts Cert in his place. That's going to be out of this round. And five on four already. Yeah, Furia might just take B after that util expires because it's been the best side for them in this map so far. And they've got a pick as well. EG are actually gambling. 4A, no B. And they might be right. Furia committing here, running up through mid. Art finds a gun on the way. There's all the CTs in the site. Tarek is close, hidden by the Ooh. smoke, but Vinny shoots him through it as it blooms. Stand with the orb. They might not expect a fifth player here. We just killed four. Guess the skin name. Oh, look, the orb has him off. My favorite. <laughs> Dude, that's the orb snake skin. What are you on about? So, um... Uh, rattling might scare Fury a little bit. They now know that it sits in the site, and they've got to run it down. Tarek's trying to hide up on the boost as well, and no one's even checked it for Fury, and now Vinny will. Boom. Zerk with the orb, got to put on a bit of a show, Ooh. and he's doing exactly that. Henny will best him the second time around and leaves this. In a two-on-two. Two. To save might be there, but they're buying up next round anyway, right? And it's a two-on-two. Two. I think you give this a look in, especially with Stan having a kit. Makes it that much more enticing. But with Henny nailing that shot, for Stanislaw, it's going to have to be a pretty nuts 1v2 that just won't happen. Furia on to seven. Stan waiting for over-aggression, but again, it's the double setup on the coffins for Furia. No reason to push. Wait for them to come to you. Henny still drawing attention in CT. EG, they've got to move now. And they do, trading effectively. Stan takes on down onto Keserato, and Henny, it's his time to shine. Oh, fully blind, deals with Breezy, has Yuri here to help out, and there's no smoke for the bomb. That means Cirque has Ooh. to be damn near flawless, and while he does hit the first shot, Henny has played this to perfection, baits the tap again, Stan is not sticking it, and Henny balls of steel oh, takes down wow. a third, and lives to tell the tale. Continuing this incredible run is Henny, 12 and one right now. They're looking to give EG a DNF in this series. Keserato with the nade, that's gonna find Ooh. a lot of damage. Tarek, great catch, but sadly not. Oh! <laughs> okay, 13 and one. How did that happen? Oh, they try and retrieve the pistol, and to their demise, Art with a double. Top B belongs to Furia, and they do rotate a man in, but with Yuri opening up this A site, that bomb doesn't even have to head into B. They can rotate away. They've got full control on the other side of the map. <laughs> but by the time you get to even checking it, it's just Keserato hanging out the tree and the bomb getting planted on a they've smoked bottom b so oh i was gonna say so it might not even be ready for the fight because Serato just swings it anyway aid at the top of b decent damage nothing too special Art flashes forward and takes ethan out crossing sandbags tarry's gonna try and post up with the orb but already dodged by art and he's got grenades to keep the man back Smoke down, Art's through it, he always is, but Tarek does hit the shot, can he get away alive? Ooh, only just, Stan does provide cover, and Tarek posts back up, and now they've smoked the cross. Boost up for EG to put Stan in position, he might be able to shut down this round, there's one. Henny with the bomb, Tarek's gone through, oh, what's he doing? He's crazy, oh. and he's gonna hit the shot, he's no scope Yuri, right through the smoke. Henny, back at the side, this would be a clutch for the ages. Yeah, 1v4, they are asking a lot. One man wrapping in through the ruins. Henny not able to catch that timing. And then Orps everywhere he looks. Tarek has had a great round. And he's looking to continue that. Henny onto the Deagle. And Breezy there to lay him to rest. EG, they find a fifth. And it takes Tarek. That's the whole reason I was brought in. So I just feel redundant. Well, that's cancelled. So moving forward. We're talking about banana control. We're talking about art. We're talking about how Henny has also emerged. And won't be there for much longer. Whoa. Breeze with two quick kills in easy succession. It's going to cause Vinny to force a fight down middle, but the B bomb site is open for the taking, and Yuri will be the first on the scene. Oh, yeah, this one. It was looking good for Furia at the start, but Breezy has bailed them out. Yeah. Now, Vinny through oh, the side. Oh, Yuri running in as well. It's all onto Cirk, and he's 10 HP. Does tap down the first, but what? somehow that two on three, oh, sorry, two on four comes up in favor of Furia. 
now primes this A hit to come through. K Serato waiting on the far Ooh. side of this smoke. It's going to start to fade. And he lands the dink on Tarik, but not the killing blow. Did snipe Breezy out from behind. And Yuri able to get up close and personal. Brings this into a three on three. Vinny's wrapping the smoke. There's the AWP from Henny. And the numbers now starting to dwindle. But Cirque has rekindled the round. Yuri out from the apartments. This is messy. This is anyone's game. And Yuri oh. offering up the 1v1 now in with a chance. Cirque in the sight, looking for the fight, and Yuri spots him, does the damage, wow. and wins out the round. Three kills for Yuri. It's another close one. Oh, but well, they could still be here. You know, we'll hang back. We'll play inside of the site. No, Art is already peeking down Banana. He has seen that there's no one here. And so Fury and No, this is an A play looming. They drop the bomb down in the pit. Yuri in with another, but it's still in the advantage of EG. Now these rotates come in from the Banana. Only MP9s to work with as they charge on up into the top of mid. EG, they might finally have the winning recipe to a round here. Smoke goes down to allow the MP9s to get in close, but they get turned to toast by Cirque, who doubles up. Six on the board for EG. Here we go, we got about three deep trying to hit Banana right now. Art not quick enough on it. There's a trade, Vinny's gonna go for the off. Subsequently get mollied into oblivion. That's it, Stanislaw has done it. They've eliminated the B threat for the time being, but the rotation in case Serato's there, and he's not one to be messed with. We need something big. Henny might die to the lurk of Breezy as well while this is happening, but he hasn't. He's given a three on three over. And now K Serato buying time. Oh, Yuri with the spam through the smoke. And K Serato still just being a Ooh. nuisance. Tarek with the 180. What? He's so low so on time. time. And he almost gets all the kills needed. This is wild, man. Okay, Tarek. Okay, then. Art's going to smoke the top of Banana. That doesn't hold EG back, and he almost gets spammed. Ooh. Run boost. Oh, Cirque nails it. Wow. And Stan follows up with another. And now they frag so hard that the entire server is dying in the process. This isn't how it was meant to go. This isn't how it was oh, meant to no. happen. Oh, what's even going on? Place your bets. Hashtag ESL Pro League. Let us know who took this round. It could go any which way. <laughs> We're picking it up from the slideshow. We've got PowerPoint running at the highest possible frames right now. And Ethan, oh. he's kept it in the 1v2. Case Serato left on the case. Now, did you say Furia? Did you say EG? Because Kay Serato, he's bowing out. He's giving it up. He's given over a ninth round to the evil geniuses. Well, they're just going to put him right on down on the apartments. Pushes down and, well, he's not going to do it alone. Art will be there with him. Oh, no. Doesn't quite matter, I suppose. Hello, a Sight, say EG. Hello, EG, says the a Sight. Tarek starts to line him up in the hallway. Now, Tarek's good to take down Vinny. Henny with the response. They're going to grab at least one AK out of that, unless Breeze can do exactly what he just did. Really tip this one upside down, and EG is still coming their way regardless. The grenades go up and down, and boy, do they do damage for EG. Follow up, though. Art blows out Ethan. Vinny spams Breezy through a smoke. Tarek has come through, but only gets one. Bomb dropped to the top of B, and no survivors. Only casualties here for EG. 3v1, it's up to the lurking ult, and Stan, he is a long way from home. Yeah, that round really did not go the way of EG. Stan gets tagged down to 10, he backs away because, well, the bomb is already compromised. It's gonna be Yuri and Henny that are controlling Banana. Stan's gonna try to flash his way through it, but he doesn't even get a chance to make it through the smoke. Henny with the spray. It's gonna be that B hit with a wrap through Spawn. Henny trying to stop it. Art holds for the jump up. The boost denied as Ethan gets picked apart and Art, ba Art backs further into the site. Tarek is waiting on a lurk, but right now it's down to the two B players with 25 seconds to do it. Tarek, here's the rotation. He is on this backstab, but this all requires his teammates to get the entries and there's not time. 20 seconds, they've got to go. Tarek finally springing his trap card, taking down Henny, and here comes the B play with 15 on the clock. Hart's just trying to bide his time, trying to waste as much off the clock as he can. Just needs to stay alive, but Tarek is able to deal with him. That round was balancing on a nice edge. Tarek back to Banana, runs out of ammo. We're into this awkward two-on-two -two now. Cirque out the coffins, a bit of a role reversal as he now tries to hold back the uncommon or incoming onslaught of Furia. Smoke down to obscure his vision. Run boost to try and get them around the corner, but it doesn't pan out. Breezy holding from CT, lines that kill up and makes it look easy. 
And for Kesarato, it's a save. He's not looking to go for this one. 12 on the board for EG. They keep it competitive. They keep it close. Art just chilling. It's going to be a pretty boring round for him, all things considered. We're going out three deep apartments for the evil geniuses. Ethan finds the first. Yuri dinks on a breeze. By that, I mean Terra. Terra falls. So this has really gone back and forth in both directions. Art, I said he was going to be bored this round, and it continues. And we were wondering if he could keep it up, and he can. And sadly, it was the rest of the guys back in the site that kind of fumbled. If so, it comes to him. Yeah, so patient, Cirque. On the other end, there it is. Art finally gets a shot. He takes it onto Ethan. That might be enough to deter EG from going towards B. Oh, no. No one's, no one's actually looking at the apartments. No one's even considering it. And this has already ruined this, this very heavy short setup before. Henny will put one on the board, but Tarek now emerging from the apartments. Yuri having to split his attention between mid and apps. Both players here, they make their presence known. The AKs ring out. Oh dear. Serato oh dropped. Dear. It's fallen onto Stan to try and carry EG to match, or map point rather, Stanislaw. There's another player wrapping in from behind and Vinny's got it dead to rights. 15 for Furia. They've got that under control. Art's even looking for a pick down the banana. Flash goes over, but he is not blind. Oh. And he removes Ethan early on. Man advantage for Furia. EG up against 15 on a map that they've been undefeated on. And Art looking to go toe to toe. Cirque's on the angle. Oh. If Art goes round, he's surely dead. It's a tag, Ooh. a trade either way, and a player close. Art's seen it, but he needs help. Vinny's there to save him. Henny with another. And Furia, they might have done it. Breezy and Tarek left in a 2v5. They've seen three at B. They know that this A site is their best and maybe only chance at saving this game, saving this series. They send Tarek in through short. They've got Breezy wrapping long, but for Kesarato and Yuri, they're just not looking to give fights up. They're holding this smoke. They're ready for a man to creep through, Ooh, and Kesarato gets it done. Wow. Furia, they finally take down EG. They put a stop to their undefeated winning streak on Inferno, and the Brazilian squad that could, they get it done. They keep